Shall I do it? Uh, let's do it. Boom. Wheels container, baby. Was going to get one for 1.6 mil, but I decided not to. So today, pretty much what I wanted to do was just go and grab a wheels container, open it up, and pop it on my Rolls Royce, because uh, I feel like this car deserves some better rims. I, I like the rims it has on, but with the color, it just doesn't add up. And I really wanted some luminous rims, just got insurance on it and everything too, so I want it to look clean. So before we put the rims on, I'm just quickly going to go and give it a nice car wash, because it looks a little dirty. There we go, all nice and clean. All right, let's pop some luminous wheels on this thing. So guys, we have wheels case number one. Now, as you guys probably already know, there are three different types of wheels cases that you can get. The one we have is right here. And I mean, the wheels that are in it aren't too shabby. I just kind of hope I don't get these two right here. The Benny's rims, I'm not a huge fan of. If I get these LV ones, I gotta admit that's pretty clean. And same with these ones. So there is a chance we can get those. These ones are pretty clean as well, and so are these. There's only three wheels I don't want. This one, this one, and this one. And this other Benny's one. So let's open it up and hope for the best. Come on, baby, give me something I love. Give me something I love. If it gives me something sick, I'm gonna be really happy. I'm actually okay with that. I am I am perfectly fine with that. It's these ones right here, I believe. Those are actually pretty clean. Let's pop it on the Rolls Royce. This is what it looks like before. And look at that, we're just carrying a wheel around. And let's go ahead and pop it on the, ooh, that does not look too shabby at all. That does not look too shabby at all. And they are wide-ish. They're not like ultra-wide, but they are fairly wide wheels. Now, I'm not 100% sure if these ones are super luminous or not. I really can't tell. So let's go ahead and turn off the lights and head into somewhere a bit dark. Okay, you could see the luminosity on it. You could definitely see it. I mean, it's not like ultra luminous, but I feel like it's definitely an improvement from the other ones because I kind of wanted to just change the wheels on this car anyways. I'm not going to lie. They're not my favorite things in the world but it is just a flex to have them. I really do want to see what those LV ones look like because they are pretty cool, but these still look pretty sick. I'm not going to lie. And it's on a Phantom. Now, I don't believe you're actually able to take the wheels off afterwards. I'm not 100% sure about that. If we flex G, there isn't really anywhere that it says we could take the wheels off. They're just permanently on there. Forgot this car was parked in a parking spot, so I can't drive into my garage. I feel like with some of the other wheels, it could have looked a bit better. One thing I'm glad about, I'm really happy I did not put it on this Wraith because this shit looks sick as hell blacked out. I would if there was like black ones we could get, then it would look clean, but on this car, it just it just can't have them. It can't have it. And shit, that costs 2.3 mil. Just so you guys know, that's how much it would cost to put rims on like a $30 million hypercar in this game. So yeah, it's pretty expensive. At least I'm not the person who bought them when they first came out for 15 mil. Because if you did that, I got to admit, you're kind of stupid. I mean, they're probably going to drop again at the end of August. Because on September 1st, I don't know if some of you guys know this, but if you guys are in the top 10 rankings, you get a free wheel crate. Now, these guys are currently at 725,000, which is a bit crazy. I am still on here. I just haven't really been doing it too much because I've been doing some other stuff. I, do, I don't even know where I am on here. There I am right there at 132,000. So that means in the next, I'm recording this on August 20th, in the next 10 days, I need to get a lot of XP. And don't forget, the guys that are in top 10 are obviously grinding this shit out every day. They're already level 30, which is max level, but they're still going. Realistically, they should be like level 70 or 80 by now. Now there is this other guy who was trying to sell his wheel crate for 1.6 million. Um, and I kind of want to buy that. I kind of do, so I'm just going to head to the bank real quick, but I'm really not that rich in this game. When you really think about it, all the people that think I'm rich, believe me, if you just go on your phone right here and go to Forbes and then scroll all the way to the end, we're going to crash our car, right here, richest people in the city. These guys have a ton of money. Like just for example, let me find my friend. He might have bought something. I don't really know. He has, he had like $120 million. I don't know if he bought a... Uh, LV top or something like that. I can't remember if he did or not, but he was like number 60 with a hundred million. So yeah, I was like 13 or number seven with like 250 or 260 million at one point. But, but yeah, there is a lot of rich ass people in this city. So that's why I feel broke. All right. Just shot him a couple messages. So the crate that he has is wheel crate number two. So that's number one. Number two is this one right here. Okay, okay, okay. I'd be okay with some of those. 
I mean, I'm not gonna lie, these actually look kinda cool, but at the same time, they don't look outstanding. What if I buy another wheel crate, and I put those wheels on this car? What will happen to these wheels that I have on it right now? Will they just disappear, or will I get them back? I feel like they could've done that a bit better. If you're allowed to just throw wheels on, you should be allowed to take wheels off and swap them with other cars. Well, I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys right now. I'm gonna go take a shit and uh, wait for him to get out of prison, because he is currently serving some time, because I'm guessing he killed somebody or did something illegal. I don't really know. Doubt anybody's gonna find me in here. Nice parking spot. Yeah, let's hope nobody comes up. All right then. So the guy took a little bit too long, so I decided to just leave. It's two in the morning and I'm really tired. One other thing I noticed about the rims, and this only happens with Rolls Races, I believe the ones I know so far are the Phantom and the Wraith. I'm not too sure about the Dawn and the Cullinan, but on the wheels right there, you guys can see it actually shows the Rolls Royce logos um, and that does it on any wheel, by the way. It doesn't matter which custom wheel you put on. It doesn't have to be luminous. It could literally be ones in a custom shop. I just think it's kind of cool. This is like one of the only cars, if not the only type of car in Grand RP that allows you to do that. You literally just pop any wheels on and it still shows the regular badging. Now, I could just go to Beach Market and buy those other wheels for like 2.1 mil. It's only like another 70k. Should I though? Uh, you know what? Let's go to the bank, grab the money, and if they're there, let's do it. Screw it. Why not? And boom, we're here. Nice. Let's see if the crate is still here. 2.1 million. Case number one. Yeah, let's buy it. Whatever. Sure. I'm good with that. I am good with that. Uh, let's see. Use. Okay. So, is it the same crate? I think it is. Well, let's hope we get the LV ones. If we do, that would be pretty cool. Come on, baby. Give me some nice wheels. Ew. Oh, that's disgusting. Now, since we can't really just pop them on any vehicle and take them off, we're going to go grab my 6x6 real quick, bring it to a custom shop, and just see what those wheels would look like on it. All right, so there's our G-Wagon, and this is what we currently have on it. We just have regular black wheels, and they are wide wheels as well. So I would hope that these wheels will also be wide. Let's take a look at what number they are. It doesn't say, but I kind of just know what Benny's rims those are because... It's really not hard to tell if you play GTA 5 or, you know, if you have eyes. I'm going to give this guy 10 more seconds or I'm going to a different custom shop. Okay, I'm really hoping all he has to do is just pick the color and then he's out. Okay, so I know it's past wheel like 104. Oh, maybe it's not. Okay, so I uh, actually know. Yeah, it definitely is. Okay, where are these new rims at? They're just past the wide wheels. See, even these look sick. If they're chrome, it actually might not look terrible. Chrome wheels don't look bad on this freaking... That actually looks clean as hell. Okay, maybe these wheels won't be too shabby. Oh, but like the... Okay. Oh, if it had the gold, I'd be down with that. This is what they are, aren't they? That's what I have. I mean, they're not bad. They're just not really that luminous. That's my issue with them. Like some of these other ones, like those are proper. Those are what I have. Or no, those are the... Uh, those are pretty cool too. These are ugly as hell, but they're LV. These are gross. Those are not my style. These are actually pretty sick. Those are definitely not my style. These are okay-ish. Eh. Okay, what the fuck? This guy really... Okay, well, if there's any admins watching, saw what this fucker just did. Those are some fucking sick-ass wheels. God damn. Oh, those are clean. Those are clean ones. Honestly, why not? Let's do it. Let's do it. Here we go. Pop them on, and there we go. I mean, it could look better. It could look a lot better. But it still looks pretty cool. It still looks pretty cool. There was a bunch of other cool ass rooms we could have gotten instead of these. But it's different. And I like that. And they are luminous, which is obviously still pretty damn nice. Not too shabby. Some of those other Benny rooms were actually really clean. They're not as gold as I thought they would be. They just looked kind of sick as hell. I'm not going to lie. Like, if we just drive into this garage down here with the luminous wheels, we should be able to see it a bit better. There we go. And now... We do a nice burnout. Looking pretty clean. Looking pretty clean. In the custom shop, I it, it didn't really look like the whole wheel was luminous like this. It just looked like the middle part was luminous. But it turns out, yeah, everything's luminous. So, yeah, it actually looks pretty nice. Actually looks pretty nice. All right, and we're back inside. That's what it looks like stock. Ugly as hell. Let's just recall this thing real quick. And boom, there we go. We got our nice luminous rims on it. I am planning to get more in the future. But right now, I kind of want to make some more money because... I did just have $51 million, and now I have $37 million, so that's not the best thing ever. 
But yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap the video for today. Thank you guys for watching. I am super tired, and I'm going to bed.